Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. How is everyone doing today? Okay. I think everything's working fine now. Apparently we lost like 60 drop frames, so not a lot. It was probably just a lag spike, but let me know if anything happens. But back with Persona. I am tired. <laughs> I am tired. I woke up like, well, at this point, like two hours ago, but I didn't fully wake up until like an hour ago. Uh, oh, she's watching Sunday again. Well, hello. Uh, so we beat the, oh shit. Yes. Harvest the vegetables. Are you going to gather the veggies? I'll go too. So, um, last night I had a massive headache and I needed to edit something for the live channel. Today's Hannibal oh, episode. So, um, I had shit to do and, uh, I was tired and I had a headache and it lasted for like six hours. It was pretty bad. And then my mom was like, hey, can you wait for like a package to arrive? So I stayed up until like noon and I went to bed at noon and I slept until 6.30 p.m. So that was my life today. Let's plan some, some eggplant, why not? Eggplant sounds fine. Why is it called an eggplant? It doesn't look anything like an egg. Okay, that's done. So, I'm super low on energy, but I wanted to do something today, otherwise I would feel pretty useless. So I, I wanted to stream some Persona or something today. So, hi, 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 how are you doing, Lucy? Welcome back in. Oh, oh yeah, we need, uh, sure, we talk, uh, Lucy and I talk about uh, some theories and possibilities of where I was starting to miss Persona. I'm sorry, I'm busy and tired. But, uh, wait, doesn't this woman sell? Yes, sell me, I don't know, corn, yes. Yeah, weed too, whatever, thank you. So, we were thinking about theory, oh, don't apologize, I just mean that I like in the game. Yeah, 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 I know, but still, um, go to town, yes. So, uh, we talk a little bit about theories about where this game could go. Do I have to do anything today? I don't think so. Oh, you know what? Josuke told me like a while ago that he wanted to watch a movie with me, like the Terminator or whatever. So might as well do that. But um, oh maybe it's uh it's August now, so maybe that movie is is, is no longer playing. Oh yeah, Return of the Trial of the Dragon. Yeah. Okay, never mind. But um. So, something that happened, uh, we were thinking, okay, where could this game go? And, like, we thought that maybe, well, you thought, initially, that, um, Naoto, the mysterious detective thing, maybe he won't give up on the investigation yet. And if the culprit is a police officer, Adachi, um, then they would see that the, that Naoto is still investigating, and that and the Naoto will be targeted next and because like and this is kind of a meta thing is that uh I think Naoto is gonna be a party member just because Naoto is in the intro and it's like a very clear main character thing so I think you know is gonna join the party and that's how he's gonna get targeted um a police officer Adachi I know I mean it it also could be Dojima like that's something that I I hasn't I haven't let go yet. Is that he could be Dojima maybe. Because he would be kind of fucked up for it to be like your fake dad or whatever. Your uncle. But Adachi gives me creepier vibes. Okay, so you go there. Chia's there. Um bunch of random people in this town. And I don't feel like talking to any of them. What's up? What's up, Hurricane? Come to think of it, there was a woman looking for a snack that doesn't taste like a snack. She might know something. A snack that doesn't taste like a snack? I have no idea. My snack tastes like snacks. Do you want some? 
Sure, I got meat gum. You should try giving this to the woman. I have no idea what they're talking about. Is it like uh like a fox thing? I think it was. Oh yeah, I think there was someone that wasn't did a snack that didn't taste like a snack. That's like a sub story mission thing. Speaking of snacks, are you ever getting hungry inside the TV? Maybe you should bring something with me next time. That would be smart, actually. Sub, you go. Oh, oh Buff Kun, what a coincidence! I just finished shopping. This reminds me, the chef and I were thinking about the new menu, menu item the other day. We'll need people to taste it, so they asked if I could invite everyone over. When the time comes, why don't we ask Mary Chan along as well? Hell yes! I'm not sure she'll enjoy it, but you know it'll be delicious. So make sure you find out if she's interested. Okay, can we can we talk to Marie? Can we do that? No. Can we register personas or something? Yeah, we could. Okay. Let's do that while we're at it. Okay, we're good. Is there anything else we talk about that we should mention? Because we did talk about a couple stuff. Um, oh, do I have a job today? No. Okay. I don't know what to do today. It's it's Sunday, so there's not a lot to do. Could I hang out with Kenji? I want to do that. Well, it's Sunday, so I'm not going to the score. So. Oh, maybe we can see a dash here at Junaeus. Maybe. Maybe. Nope. Not here. Alright, never mind. It's always weird whenever you get days that there's like nothing you can do with them. Okay, no one. I think I'm just going to... I'm just going to watch a movie and then go to sleep. Very realistic, honestly. Yes! Actually, very realistic. Alright, Trial of the Dragon. Um... Let's hang up. I could invite Teddy. Let's invite Teddy. Let's see if Teddy enjoys Trial of the Dragon. Hello? Hello, what's up? Oh, it's weird to call Yosuke and be like, hey... Can I talk to Teddy? And Yosuke's like, but you're my f I know, but I want to talk to Teddy, not you, Yosuke. And then Teddy's like, I'm gonna go hang out with Senpai! And Yosuke's like, but I wasn't invited! I know. Oh, you want to talk to Teddy? Hang on a second. Hello, this is Teddy! Huh? Oh, the movies? With me? Of course I'll go! I'll go with you! Hmm, so I need to go to the movie theater or Okina, right? Gotcha! See you there! And Yosuke's listening in, like... Just him though. Sorry to make you wait. Hi, Sensei. I want Max Pit to get here as soon as possible. Did he run all the way here? Let's go. Let's go. Okay, let's watch a movie. You felt an adrenaline rush from watching the main character vanquish his enemies with manly battle cries. You enjoy watching the movie with Teddy. Something inside of Teddy changed the response to the movie. Yeah. Build up. Oh, I got a new skill, too. And bonuses, yeah. Probably shouldn't do this with people that I'm not gonna use in my party. Wow, a colossal epic! I was so mesmerized, I can't even remember when the snacks I ate tasted like. I wanna go again sometime, Sensei. Okay. Alright, that was my day. Oh, I got an achievement. Movie buff. Watching movies. Welcome home, Big Bob. Okay. Not much to do here. We're thinking about uh, going to like a festival or something. Of it. Oh, phone. Blood? Or maybe someone tells me to hang out with them. It's from Chie. The time has come. Return of the Trial of the... Tr <laughs> this is funny. It's out! I was gonna say, it's gonna be so good. Come with me. That's all I have to say. Why do all... Why do they all type like this? I understand they're dumb teenagers, and I also understand this is like 2008 or whatever, but like... 
The movie Chia I wanted to watch is not being shown at the theater. If you go to the movie theater, perhaps you're shown by Chia. Alright, I'll watch the movie again, but with Chia now. Mm hmm Okay, what do? Oh yeah, we could buy shit at the TV. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> It's weird because like this is such a like cheery song, catchy cheery, and the everything that they say sounds so energetic, but you look at the guy and he doesn't look energetic. He looks like he hates his life. <laughs> now let's introduce the products available for these race. The Maneki Neko times one. We wish you the best of the best. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it's wonderfulness. I'll add giant candy times two to your Maneki Neko. All for 8,000 yen. We got another fantastic product on sale today. Two smart bombs. Help remember your child's schedule. On top of this, I'll add supersonic times two to your smart bomb for only 7,000. Okay, I have no idea what any of these do. So, so fuck it. Let's buy uh, the Maneki Neko, whatever it is. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you, Tanaka. Alright. Anyway, let's... Wait, weren't we reading something? Check that out. We started reading fishing, so let's learn how to fish. We don't have a pole, but we learn how to fish. I don't see why not. Okay. All you can do is now wait for the police to make their move. What should you do today? Oh, it wasn't even a Sunday, it was a fucking... It's a Tuesday. Okay, sure, anyway. She's still watching Sentai. Nothing has changed since yesterday. Is there anything we can do today, though? Oh, we didn't plant the seeds. I should plant the seeds, like, later tonight. Oh, no, we did plant eggplant. I'm sorry. So, are we in... Yeah, we're in summer vacation, I think. Yeah. Summer break. Yeah, never mind. So, no school time. But, like, how do I hang out with, like, Kanji, though? <laughs> how do I hang out with Kanji, then? All right. Is Marie here? Marie's there. Let's go! You're late. Oh, you came. Hey, before we go looking for my memory, there's some place I want to go. I want to leaven things up. That's okay, right? Marie wants to go somewhere today. Yes, yes, let's yes. Go. Finally, I know. Yeah, let's go. Marie looks happy. Harry, let's go. Take me out. He just had to take Marie out. <laughs> She's like a little bit pushy. I, I, I like that. Open this string, so side Daitaku. At Marie's insistence, you have come here to eat steak skewers. Huh? Huh? Isn't it a bit Bob Kun and Mary Chan? Haha, <laughs> we meet again! Yo. Yo, Senpai, what are you doing here? Oh god, everyone's here. Everyone just just walking to this one corner. I mean, there's only like three places to hang out in the city, so I don't blame them. I don't think I could handle someone push in real life, but it's wonderful for her character. Uh, yes, her character makes sense that she's a little bit pushy, and I like that, actually. Her character as a whole, I like a lot. Kenji, I know, the boy. Everyone's here. Oh. Hey, no fair! You're all here without me? You gotta call, you know? Everyone seems to have gathered around. You spent a fun time with everyone, including Marie. It's grown late, so you leave everyone and score Marie back to the velvet room. That was it? Aw. I was hoping we would get more, but sure. Don't say the liver for you, left it on the table. Yeah, I got my Maneki Neko, whatever it might be. Um, luck by four. I'll take four luck. Four luck seems fine. Can we spend time with you? Yes. Yes. 
isn't ready to advance yet. Well, that sucks. Okay, so nothing here. I'm glad that I'm giving Marie friends. <laughs> okay, Thursday. Is it good? There's gonna be a rain on Saturday, so maybe something will happen. Yes, well, she did today. I don't know, can I spend time with Marie? I'm kind of missing their winter outfits, honestly. Because I think everybody looked better in their winter outfits. Except for, like, Chie. I like Chie's... I like how Chie looks in the regular uniform, actually. But everyone else, I think, looked better with the winter clothing. Well, I'm also someone that prefers winter clothing by default, so... Damn it, she's not here. Do I have to read a poem or something? No, okay. Leave. Yeah, I agree. Mm. Where, where's my boy Kenji, though? Like, if I can... If I'm gonna have to spend time with someone, I wanna spend time with the characters that I like the most. But I don't know... I don't even know where... Th there he is! Can I spend the day with you? Can I do that? Textile shop. No, no, not the tech... To him. Yo. Yo, Senpai, what you doing here? Oh, yeah, how's she doing? That girl. I mean, Mary... Mary... Mary whatever it was... Nah, I ain't worried about her or nothing. She just seems like someone you can't leave on her own. Hey, hey, don't get the wrong idea. I ain't interested in a brat like her, okay? Well, Tori said hi, and that she ought to come along next time we get together. I like that they talk about Marie. Yeah. Yeah, Senpai, you have some time? Yes, free time. The other day I tried going at top speed on my bike and I passed this old hag on her scooter, no problem. I wonder if the others got their licenses yet. I'm ready to take him on any time. He's going to become closer soon. Yes, 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 yes. You want to stop by my place? My ma, she wanted to, ma said she wanted to meet you. Oh, this is, oh, that's great. Oh, I love that. First of all, we're already at your place. We're literally standing at the door. Second, I love the fact that he's like, oh yeah, ma, I make some friends. And she's like, oh, oh, bring them over next time so we can meet them. Because, because Kanji probably doesn't have a lot of friends. Or any friends, really. So it's probably while for the mom to be like, oh, my boy made, made friends. I hope they're nice people. I, I, I hope I can meet them. So that that's, I love that. Central shopping district. You came to Tatsumi Textiles. We were already standing there, but don't worry about that. Senpai. Better warn you, there's nothing fun here. <laughs> There's gonna be fun shit. Hey ma, I'm home. Huh? It's not there? She ain't here. What's she doing leaving the store open? Kanchan, there you are. Your mother's in the hospital Oh god. The hell? The the hospital? Uh Um, let's, let's just go. Let's just go. Huh? Oh, yeah, I need to go and see. Let, let's, why? I thought this wasn't plot. I only heard from a customer, but she's at Inaba Municipal Hospital. I mean, it's not plot, but it is character plot. When you do free time events with the characters, you get character plot. So, like, her, his mom is not going to be, like, main story plot, but... There could be a story regarding his character and stuff like his family. Hurry, go! Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah, I mean, like happy times. No, there's no happiness to be found in the city. There's murder and sickness, and well, Bob seems pretty chill. Bob, Bob's happy. But, uh, oh, she's. Is that her? I think that's her. Ma! Okay, so she's fine. But why are we here? Or is she fine? You are right. You were taken to the hospital. Someone do this to you? Goodness, but you look pale. Never mind me. What about you? Huh? You're okay? 
I wasn't taken to the hospital. I took someone. Okay. Huh? That kid? The poor things got hit by a bicycle right in front of our shop. He hit in his head, so I had a doctor examining him. He said there's no damage, thank goodness. The one who hit him was a boy from your school. When he saw the poor child fall, he ran away. Why don't you find him and give him a little scolding? <laughs> oh, I love this. Okay, first of all, she's fine. Second of all, we get to see Kenji worry about her, her his mom. Second, we get to see the mom see that Kenji worries about her. Four, the mom is like, go beat his ass for for de for injuring this child. Go find that kid and beat the shit out of him. I see that Kenji's mother talks like him. A little bit. That's what I love. Cut the crap! You have no idea how I felt. <laughs> I'm fine. Your mother isn't kicking the bucket that easily. It's not like you to get so worried over such little things. I disagree. This is very much like Kenji to get worried about his mom. Shut up, you old cow! Well, he talks like that too, so... Well... So he got super worried. And now he feels... Ashamed that he got worried. Sorry, looks like it was no big deal. I mean, it's it's fine. Like I like Kenji a lot. He he's the best. I also love that Kenji's mom is also like secretly a badass. He's complicated like that. He's he's our boy. He's our son. You no. <laughs> it's funny that the option is right there though. It, that option is funny, but you never want to pick that option. Um, I don't blame you. Hmm. It, yeah, if it's not just me, then I guess it's okay. He still looks embarrassed. It's f it's fine. I thought I faced all of my bad parts back there, but not everything can change just like that, huh? Uh, uh sorry for dragging you around. If I'd been by myself, I might have been even more scared. <laughs> Hope I can refer to the favor. Yes, I, I was able to support Kanji. You sense he's trusting you. Yes. Emperor 3, Kanji. Let's go! Yes. You're gonna perform a follow-up attack during battle. Good. I'm going home. Oh man, we didn't get to hang out. Oh, we get to talk to the mom now, maybe? That boy. We were both going home. He didn't have to run away like that. Oh, you're Harukun. You came to our store with Yuki-chan, right? I've been hearing a lot about you from Kanji. Sent by this and sent by that, he must really like you. Does he now? Does he? I'm sorry to have made you both come all the way here. He hates hospitals, you see. Hmm? His father, my husband, died here. Oh, that's another layer, too. His dad died here in the hospital. So he's a little bit traumatized over that fact. So he doesn't like being in a hospital to begin with. I understand a feeling like that because... Well, it's not that I don't like hospitals or, or anything. But, like, I remember... So... I don't really visit hospitals or, or do any treatments to myself but i feel like i would have an irrational fear over something like that because i don't know if i told the story before on stream but i do have um i don't know if you can see it because of the lighting i don't think you can maybe if we do this you could i have a scar there you can see it i have a scar on my forehead right right here and it's pretty visible and I got that when I was four. I was I was actually four years old, and um, I ju I just ran full speed into a stone wall, and I fissured my skull. And when that happened, okay, so that that wasn't the bad part. In fact, I vividly remember the event. I just ran into the wall, and I was like, well, it was like my entire body vibrated. And then I was like, oh man. And then I just turned around. 
walked up to my caretaker, teacher, whatever, because this happened in kindergarten. Like, this actually happened in kindergarten. And I turned out to her and I was like, hey, miss, do I have something on, on my face? And she wasn't looking at me. She was talking to someone else. And then she turned around to look at me. And I saw her face contorted into this expression of pure horror. And then she just started screaming. And I was like, then I touched my forehead and I said, just my entire hand was red. And I was like, all right, I'm dead. But the bad part was that um, I was rushed to the hospital and they had to, they had to stitch my, like do a surgery and stitch my forehead. Um, there was no, <laughs> there were no anesthetics on the hospital because our, our city is shitty like that. So they weren't prepared or ready for something like that to happen. So there were no anesthetics. So uh, they had to do that without without me being high on anesthetic. So I, I could feel the whole process. And when I was four, I don't remember anything about the event other than me lying on a table and the entire room was dark and I was just screaming and it was just pain. And there were people like above me. That's like all I remember. Then fast forward several years when I had to go to the dentist to get like a regular checkup or something, they like I had such an irrational fear of people just that's a terrible experience. I did something similar as a baby, run into a statue but the scar is so little and on my finger. I mean finger scars are fine. I actually do kind of have one. And it's weird because I had it as with like a scissor. But the scissor didn't actually cut my finger, like it didn't bleed, but it almost cut something inside of the finger so now there's a scar in there can i show that one can you see that one now this one's more difficult to see maybe barely but it's there's like a, a diagonal line there but um i cut my finger with a scissor but it didn't bleed it just like cut something inside and it never went away i had this for like 10 years the thing is that uh since what i said about my head fissuring and the anesthesia there were not being anesthetics well when they did that procedure on me it made it so whenever i went to like at the dentist or something i just started like freaking out panicking and sometimes just screaming and there was like one instance where i needed to go to the dentist to do like a checkup for like school or something and uh i just ran away i just straight up stood up and ran away from from like the dentist chair i was like no don't touch me i'm just running away like when I was like 10 or 12 or whatever and I literally could not go back there for the checkup and it was just a checkup like if there was there were, they didn't have to do any procedures on me it was just a checkup and I just ran away every time and then me and my mom just went home and I didn't have the checkup done on me because I couldn't because I was so freaked out and I think looking back that that is actually some sort of like a minor level trauma of when that happened to my forehead like it's it's like a small like trigger to me to be in a situation where i'm like i'm just sitting or or laying there and somebody's doing something to my face and i can see it and it's just like i'm freaking out so i can understand it's not the same as what is happening to Kanji here, but it made me think of that. And it's also like the thing about like fears being irrational and something that like you kind of don't have much control over. Like spiders. <laughs> me and spiders. I will tell you about my trauma with hospitals later. Oh, okay. You can tell me. That's fine. Hospitals suck. <laughs> hospitals just suck in general. Fuck hospitals. Okay. I also don't really do checkups or anything, but it, it might be tied to that. I haven't been to a hospital in... Ever? I, I have no idea. I have no memory. That's how long it's been since I last went to a hospital. But I should though, because I'm, I'm gonna be 25. And I need to make sure that I'm not, like, dying. So... Anyway. Kanji happened to be somewhere else when he collapsed, so I think he was scared today. Haha, <laughs> but it's good to see you. He's always had trouble getting along with people. He didn't have any friends like you before. Yeah, like I said, he doesn't really have friends. 
Why do I have to choose one of these three? I mean, it's all three. Well, any friends like you? What does that mean? I mean, this almost sounds like the game is telling you what is the thing that you are harsher on Kanji about? And the answer is ain't none of them. Kanji's great, shut up. I mean, his attitude can be sometimes a little bit weird. Like he just yell at his mom, you old hag, you old cow. So like sometimes he says something that he maybe he shouldn't. But he's really nice when he doesn't. Bob. Let's... Let's say looks. I feel like people have a hard time approaching people that in Japan that look like Kanji. Because Kanji just straight up looks like a delinquent. Blonde hair, piercing. Does he have piercings? I think so. He just looks like a delinquent. And I feel like people in Japan have a hard time just approaching anyone that looks like that. Because Japan society is weird like that. No, he was so cute when he was young. When was it that he began to wear scary clothes like that? He would always rather play house instead of catch or go home uh, e to go home easy instead of PE. Oh, this is great. I love it. So he never had any male friends, but the girls didn't accept him either. After a while, he started getting into fights every day and bleaching his hair. I was worried about him, but lately he seems to be having fun. Please take care of him. You feel you understand Kendra a bit more. You parted ways with Kendra's mother and went home. Yeah, so you should have just said uh, uh, hobbies. So I don't think that was actually Bob being like judgmental or anything. That was just like the three options that the game gave you. Oh, she's not watching Santa. She's watching a, 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 a show. Like a game show. Yeah, that looks like a game show. Anyway, we spent time with Kanji, that felt good. Alright. Let's go learn how to fish. I wonder how I get a pole. That's what I want to know. How do I how do I get a pole? Beginner fishing, yes. Yes, yes. Willpower is very important for a fisherman. Yes. I will be able to fish longer now. Maybe I could already fish, I just don't have a pole for it. Yes. These days just fly by. Because, uh, summer break, so... I wonder how long until we hit the plot. Alright, who can we hang out with today? Can we hang out with A, Marie, B, Kanji, C, no one? Those are my two options. Well, I think I can hang out with like Shia or something, but like I don't want to. Marie's not there, goddammit. Hey, I should sell my shit that I got on the dungeon. The blacksmith. Have you come see my art? Please look around, take your time. So, sell everything for 62,000 yen, yes. Yes, 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 I know. You know, I know, there's a lot of new shit that you can make now. Don't worry about that. There we go, finally. Okay. We're gonna buy an edge now. Um, more strength, very sharp blade from from a western world. I mean, I kind of don't like the sword that Bob is currently wielding. Like, I don't like how it looks, so let's try this one. Yes, equip and sell the gothic sword. Yes. Got Oh, Chia can get some cool shit. Plus, I made high odds. Okay. Yukiko. More strength. Kanji. Alloyed plate. A plate made from an alloy that can withstand very high temperatures. You know, Kanji could use a new a new weapon. Not an actual desk. 
Okay. That will be fine. If we need to buy anything later, we can do that later. I just really came here to sell. Hey, Reese is here. We could spend time with Reese, eh? We haven't done that yet. I do like Reese. Eh? I feel like we can all agree that Reese is fine. She's a pretty good character. Okay, Kanji's not there. Therefore, Reese. Oh, Senpai. Hey, Senpai. Are you out shopping? That was so much fun the other day hanging out with Marie Chan. But I'm not crazy about how Yosuke Senpai seems so ahead over heels for her. I mean, think about it. Isn't he supposed to be a reset super fan? <laughs> Why isn't he simping over me? Speaking of all that, how's Marie Chan doing? She got a mouth on her, but she's really pretty cute. Next time we all get together, we should call her up too. I like that they all talked about Marie. I like oh, that a lot. Senpai. Oh, Senpai. I just turned my chef at the store. Are you free today? Yes. Yes. Uh -huh. Yeah, where should we go? Oh, I wonder. What bonuses will Risa get in combat if she's not a combat character? Oh, this is interesting. Maybe she'll get new abilities that'll help you out for, for general usefulness. Yeah, where should we go? She looks happy. Okay. Bum, bum, bum. So it's like Daigaku. You came at Reese's earnest request. I can't take another bite. My stomach's full. But that really hit the spot. I haven't wanted to come here. But it's a little embarrassing to show up alone, you know? Um. The sort of thing. It's not the same thing. You don't need out? <laughs> nope. If someone snapped a photo of me doing that, I heard from my leg I heard here from my agency. The last time I ate out was at a festival when I was still a little kid. That was that's that's a long time ago. Like I don't know, like six years ago. Like it's been a while. Back then, it was me and my family. It was fun. She's smiling nostalgically. To know the truth, I wanted to do this since I was a child. My parents were actually pretty strict. I didn't really have many friends. Though I guess that couldn't be helped since I hardly ever showed up for school. Uh, that's enough talk about that. What a depressing subject, huh? Let's talk about something fun. After all, I don't want to waste the time we have together. It's so great that I came to this town and met you. Really, I'm serious. <laughs> Fell, yes. Okay, nice and simple. It's the first one, so it makes sense that it was nice and simple. Mm -mm. She got weakness scan. Wait. Oh, I want to read that again. Why don't I start by asking what kind of girl you like? Uh. Let's go, senpai. Marie Chan. <laughs> He dealt with Reese's barrage of questions until it became dark, then went home. Oh. Welcome home, Big Bob! Okay. Oh, let's find time in Nanako. But, like, something I wanted to mention before I forget is, um, is how weird it is for, like, for people that become pseudo-celebrities or just straight-up celebrities when they're young. It really, it really fucks with their development as people, because like I feel like people are not equipped to deal with that, with the with the idea of people just freaking out about you and being and putting you in that weird pedestal, pedestal. So, I remember reading about I I watch a video that that compiled a lot of information about Angry Three Thousand, which is um. Andrew 2000 was a member of Outkast, which was like a rapper duo or something, or pop or whatever. I don't exactly know what to classify as, but they made that song that's uh, it's called Hey Ya, and it's a really popular song. They have a, a couple other hits, but Andrew 2000, he talked about how he became like really popular, kind of a celebrity really, when it was like 17. So he talked about how 
being a 17 year old and having to focus on all this like grown up things but not only grown up but also dealing with this weird fame thing it really fucked with him to the point that like in his late 20s like more than a decade later he started to realize how stunted his development was and he was like there's a lot of basic things that i just don't know how to do and i just kind of had to try and learn as i went when i was like on my 30s because i never got to do them because i just i just skipped from being a teenager into celebrity also as a teenager and that kind of really fuck with him as a person and he realizes that and he's trying to like compensate for it and like i think that's such a weird thing that happens and i'm i'm actually like a little bit worried about our our current like weird internet fame culture that we have because there's a lot of like teenagers that are like i don't know like popular youtubers or instagrammers or, or tiktok or whatever and that's not to say that it's necessarily a bad thing, but I am worried about them because I feel like most people are not equipped to deal with that. Most people are not equipped to deal with that amount of attention. I legitimately worry for a lot of those people. Anyway, let's spend time with Nanako. Okay, we're gonna level up this time, so. Yeah. Yay. So anyway, reset makes me think of that. So in a way, I do feel for her. Oh, hey, he's here. Welcome home. Or once he's home. Dad. Um, he's not paying attention to her. He's paying attention to like the desk. So. I'm sorry. Later, Nanako. <laughs> he came in here and he was like, "Sorry, I just need to get some papers," and then he walks away again. But but this paper. Scheduling of parent-teacher interviews. Oh, I remember. That's what happened last time with Nanako. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man. A survey, huh? Mm -hmm. Fine. It's fine. It's fine, okay? You don't have to write anything. You don't have to come. It's just another case of you, right? It's more work, isn't it? Bad people and everyone else are more important to you than me, huh? Oh, this is rough. This is rough. You're not real. You're not my real dad. Bob is my real dad. Hey. Nanako, wait. I mean... <laughs> Bubbles finally bursting. Do you realize what's happening here? <sighs> what's gotten into her? I don't know. Oh my god. <laughs> this dude is just... Do you not realize what happened? What part of what she said wasn't clear to you? Let's go look for her. Uh. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Now it's not the time to send around asking questions. I mean... I'll go check Junae's hair. Oh, she ran away from home? Not to her room? Okay. You look around the shopping district. Counting on, you. Counting on you. Okay. You need to find Nanako. I mean, it's gonna be me to find her. And then I'm gonna talk to her and be like, actually, you should approach your dad this way or whatever. And then she's gonna be like, you're right. And then we're gonna meet him and he's gonna be like, I'm sorry, or hey. whatever. Oh, it's Yosuke? I ran into Dojima San at Junez and he told me what happened. Sheesh. You could have just asked. We got a call from Yosuke kun. I'm sure if we all look, we'll find her. It's nice. All my friends are here to try and search for her. Hey, do you know what kind of places she might have gone? A place where Nanako would Junez. <laughs> you recall that Nanako said her family used to go to Samigawa with her mother was still alive. Oh, okay. I told your friends about Samigawa. Hmm. Samigawa? All right, all right, Bob, you hear it straight up there. That's our best bet. The rest of all will split and look for clues. If anyone finds anything, give the others a ring, okay? Okay. It's weird whenever this happens, because... Bob, did you find Nanako? Because, like, you know she'll be fine. Because this is not, like, main plot. But still. Damn. Damn it, where is she? 
Okay, she's Not safe. Ugh. Could you talk to her? I'm not her real father, huh? Please. Bob, you should go pick her up. She'll listen to you. <sighs> How do we play this? I mean... I kinda wanna say one. Because like, br bro, this is not my job. This is your job. Like, the thing about Dojima is that, like, he beats himself down and he just gives up. And I literally just have to slap him in the face and be like, go talk to your daughter. Pay more attention to her. If I was a kid and my father didn't try to mend it, I would feel worse. I'm sure Nanako wanted him to run together. I know. Like, I, I know that. Okay, let's do this. Like, three is not the one I'm gonna choose. I'm just stuck with doing one and two, but that's supposed to be one. No, it is. You're her family, much more than I am. As long as Nana goes okay, I'm fine. Like, that's the thing, is that he cares, but he... He kind of runs away from the responsibility because he feels like he can't, he can't be there. Hi, Harry and Lucy. Hi, Shampi. How are you doing today? How are you doing? We're doing the Nanako thingy. I'm, I'm doing fine. I'm tired. I'm tired, but here we are. Doing great. Okay, I'm glad. I'm glad. Nanako is not doing great. We're, we're chasing after her because she ran away. Anyway, Dojima, go talk to your daughter. Please. Motherfucker! Big bro! This is too sad for me. Your dad's worried. But then why didn't he come to get him himself? Liar. Exactly. I will be gone for a bit. That's fine. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Nanako looks like she's about to cry. You told Nanako that her father was the one who found her. Huh? Who's looking for me? But why isn't he here? Did Dad say anything about the river? Did he forget about Mom? He never talks about her. I want to see Mom. Mm -hmm. She's struggling to not to cry. Through Nanako's fears resolve, you feel that your relationship with her has grown deeper. I just want this kid to be happy. <laughs> Honestly. Dad must have forgotten Mom. There are any pictures of her at home. He probably threw them all away. I mean, the thing is that she's also too young to understand that this is like probably super painful for Dojima. The thing about her. Because he probably thinks about her often, but he just doesn't want to get reminded every five seconds. Because he has issues facing reality, almost. He kind of wants to run away, consistently. But she doesn't understand this because she's a kid. Is he going to throw me away too? He hasn't forgotten. He won't abandon you. He hasn't forgotten. I'm going home. Let's go home together. You're my only real family. Okay. You call your friends and told them Nanako was safe. Okay, that's good. Okay. Oh, it's raining. Oh, it's Saturday, too. Can I spend time with anyone today? So, things to do. One, spend time with Marie. Two, spend time with Kanji. Three, spend time with Rise. Four, go watch a movie with Chie. Because she wanted to, so. 
Maybe we could do that. Let's see if there's anyone around. I'm back. Good. Hello. Welcome back. No one here. We're just doing social links today. Mostly. Yeah, of course there's no one here. Okay. Can we... I'm gonna try Jeunesse. Maybe Adachi is there. That would be interesting. He's not. Never mind. Going to town. Can we watch a movie today? Because it's rainy. Maybe not, but... It's not rainy here. Yes, yes, yes. Chia wanted to watch this, so let's call Chia in. Oh, what's going on? The movie theater is Okina. Sure, sounds fun. I'll see you there a little before the movie starts. Thanks for waiting. The movie hasn't started yet, has it? Oh, wait, it's just me and you? Well, never mind. Well, let's go inside the theater. Mm hmm. This doesn't have to be weird, girl. You feel an adrenaline rush. Yes. Enjoy watching the movie, Chie. She got an extra level and a move. Heat wave. What's that? Medium physical damage to all enemies. That's pretty good. It's actually pretty good. Is it better than Rampage or not? Because this only hits once. Rampage hits up to three times. I suppose this is more consistent damage than Rampage. She got a lot of stats from that. Awesome. That was great! I got so fired up! I even cried! Man, the Child of the Dragon series is just isn't just entertainment, it's a way of life! Okay. Thank you for taking me out. It was tons of fun. Let's go again. Yes. Okay. I am glad you enjoyed your time here. Welcome back. Hi. <laughs> what is this option? It's standing outside. It will take your belly button. A hey, belly button. Belly buttons come off. Um, yes. Um. Uh, okay. Spend time yeah. with her. Yeah. Just level up the social link, since this is like the only thing we can do at night. Someday. Okay, what are you selling today, Tanaka? Paladin armor. And longevity pills. And then a kitchen knife. I'll add a myth-like sword. The thing is that the kitchen knife is a Yosuke item, I think. And I kinda- I'm not interested in that. What about the Paladin Armor? That could be fun. That would be a good item. Let's buy the Paladin Armor. Do I get Holy Light? Do I get Lay on Hands? I barely buy anything from Tanaka. Yeah, honestly... I kind of don't feel too much like it, but might as well check it out since I don't have like anything else to do during summer break. Okay, go to town. Is Marie there? Is my girl here? She's there. She's there. Let's go. You're late. Oh, you're here. Let's go somewhere. You're helping Marie remember, right? You did promise Marie that you would help her find her memories. Yes, hurry, let's, go. Day. let's go! I want to hurry up and remember. Since Marie can't wait. 
She's becoming more and more eager. I kind of like that. I just had to take Marie somewhere so she can calm down. It's a Megawa Riverbank. Marie practically dragged you here. So about my memories, what do you think I should do? Um, first meditate. <laughs> I see why you like her so much. I mean, there's a lot of reasons why I like her. But more importantly, from first of all, her design is great. Okay. Are there any clues? I don't know. First meditate. <laughs> I kind of just want to say meditate. Just, just close your eyes and reach your place of peace. And just stare deep inside your mind. I don't know. Any clues? Meditate. Marie, meditate. She's not gonna meditate. But it'll be a funny option. It's difficult to say. Meditate? But ah, that's a tongue twister. How will that help? The only thing I remember is this. Maradulada. Mary shows you the bamboo comb again. If you remember, I told you that I had this when I first started remembering. Will this help? It's not a bamboo. Is it sold somewhere? What do we choose? What do we choose? Does it even matter? I don't know. Maybe we can find something out if we find it where we got it from. But this doesn't look like the ones at Janae's. They don't look anything like this. Mario looks very interested for once. It seems older. Do you know of any stores that may sell, may sell stuff like this? What store around here might deal in old comps like that? Oh god. I mean, textiles? I'm assuming that's gonna be textiles. This is a tofu shop, and we just said Juno's you know, Dustin, so that's my textiles. You recall that Kenji's family runs a textile shop? He might know something about the old bamboo comb. You told Marie about that's me textiles. That old timer's place? Hmm, that's kinda surprising. Let's go. Well, let's go. The shopping district, was it? Hey, got a second? Yeah, what's ha what what's happening? <laughs> Decided to go that's some textiles with Marie. Hmm. Oh, Risa's here. What's happening, Shampei? Yo. Yo, welcome. Oh, oh, Senpai. Oh, Senpai. Oh, Senpai, what a coincidence. Oh, Marie Chan's with you, too. Huh? Oh, wait, don't tell me the two of you are on a date. Um. We have business here. First off, are you keeping Yukiko on your team? Yes. My team right now is Chie, Yukiko, and Kanji. I don't know if I'm going to swap any of them in or out, but like, it's going to stay like that, at least for the next dungeon, because I don't have any new party members. Okay, good. Why? Um, I kind of want to see this just to see Risa's reaction to it. I feel like Marie maybe wouldn't care. Oh, maybe she would, actually. I just kind of want to see Risa's reaction. I want to know if you could go, um, Will has my... You could go Will ha have my in charge. I have no idea what that is, so I don't know if she'll have it. I don't think I have it yet. I can check later, but I don't think she has it. Um, we have business here. Jeez, don't scare me like that. Hey, Kanji, Senpai needs to talk to you. Huh? What's up? This. Do you know what this says? Tell me anything you know. Anything at all. This thing? It's a... It's a com. A pretty damn old one. It's a com? It doesn't look like it. It's very easy to use. With that shape. A move that doubles your magic attack. That would be pretty cool, honestly. I don't know if she has that. I mostly just use Yukiko for healing. Unless we need to deal fire damage, then she deals really good fire damage, but. 
So, what do you want from me? You need me to figure out where this thing came from? Anything will help. Uh, I don't know anything, but... Hey, mom, come over here. Yo! Oh, yeah, Kenji's mom might know something about it. I hear you, I hear you. Don't shout so loud. Oh, hello. I haven't seen you in a while. Is this girl another of Kenji's friends? She wanted to know about this comb. Do you know anything, mom? A comb? Let me see. Mm, this is very old. I'm sorry, we don't carry anything like this one. Can you tell me anything about it? Anything at all? Hmm. I've never seen a comb shop like this. I don't think it would be for everyday use. You might have better luck asking at a museum or a gallery than a clothing store. A museum? This is like an old dynasty comb or something. Oh, so it's rare. Well, I don't know if it's rare, but it's definitely not something that would be sold around here. Huh? If it's not sold, then where's somebody gonna get one? Come on, lady, help us out here. Don't talk to your mother like that. Uh, I'm sorry I couldn't be of any help, but I've really never seen anything like this. Why do I have this? Why would I have given it as a gift? I'm not so sure about that. Combs don't make very good gifts. The word, the word for cum, cushy, has the sound for the words for pain, ku, and death, she. Wow. Okay, sure. Sure. It's an old belief that comms have the power to cause separation, but I don't know if kids today care about that stuff. That sounds like maybe it matters. Just looked up her moves. Okay, yeah. She doesn't have it. Okay, cool. Oh well. Yeah, like I checked up a couple moves on the Persona Wiki. For for random Personas that you get, because it tells you what moves they're gonna get in the future. That's pretty useful. Huh, I didn't know about that. But now that you think about it, it does have those words in it. Are you in, Tatsumi-san? Maya have a word with you. I am coming. Just a moment, please. Please, Kanji, see to our guests. I need to speak with a customer. Please make yourselves at home. Pain and death, huh? Well, I guess they wouldn't want to give some of that. She said separation. I didn't know that comps are actually bad luck. Separation. I love this USC. Yeah, the entire soundtrack is good. Marie. Marie Chan, are you alright? Does your head hurt? Whoa, you okay? Sit your ass down and get some rest! Oh my god, Kanji. I love how... I love everything that Kanji says. <laughs> Honestly. Marie grimaces. Do you, <laughs> Do you remember something? I don't know. But there's something. Uh, it's gone, I can't remember. Something came up in my mind. I was almost about to recall it. Marie looks vexed. What? You can't remember? You don't remember anything about that comb? Huh? Oh, wait a second. That's not your comb. Don't worry about it. That's my problem. There's still so much we don't know about Marie. I know. You know more than I do. This is a normal comb, huh? What did she say? A museum? A gallery? I gotta remember something if I go to one of those. You help too. You can feel Marie's trust for you. Yes. No, I don't. Oh, do you not? I thought you spent more time with her. We're only at six. We should be at like nine. The game didn't want me to hard lock Marie. I'm tired. I'm going home today. But let's continue this later. All right. What's up with her? Marie Chan's a bit mysterious. Senpai, Marie-chan's leaving! I can see that. Well, see ya. After thanking Kenji and Rize, you escort Marie back to the double room. We're at the same rank. Okay, cool. So you've only done this. Welcome back! Okay. Nothing to do there. 
death or separation. So she's a ghost or she's separated from someone. Better than no clues. Yes. Those are the two things that I thought immediately too. She could just straight up be a ghost. I mean, they did kind of say that she isn't human or some shit. And she can hang out in the Velvet Room often. So like... That's something that you already th can think about. Not necessarily a ghost, but like a, some sort of a spirit entity. Let's... Let's work. Let's do translation. Ghost or a goddess. Since you're completely raised English made easy, yeah, you get more. You can counter a sentence on written for a child. Yeah. Separated from her human form. Oh shit. She her spirit form is hanging out inside of her body, and her body is 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 a random human that is in the real world. Maybe. Okay, let's keep going. Time, yes. Thanks for reminding me, bro. Bye. Okay, sure. Okay, she's not there, so not a Marie day. Not a Risa day. You're welcome. <laughs> Is it a Kenji day, though? Can we have a Kenji day? Can we have a Ken Kenji's not there? Well, fuck my life then. What are we supposed to do if Kenji's not here? We could spend time with Chie. Yo! Yo, Harakun! Funny coincidence bumping into you here! Man, I took another look at my closet the other day and thought, wow, that they really are all green. It made me remember what Marie-chan said to me. <laughs> oh, by the way, how is she doing? Tell her I want to go clothes shopping with her again. I love that they all talk about Marie. Oh, I don't see you out here very often. It seems you could have some free time. Well, thanks for that. Reminds me, I found out you're only allowed to go 60 kilometers an hour on a scooter. Or was it 30 kilometers an hour? Either way, doesn't that seem slow to you? No, I'm good. I see. I had to check the death confidence. Okay. I'm sorry, Yukiko. I don't. I don't. I don't want to do that. Can he? Yeah, let's work at the daycare. Let's see if we can lock uh, an arcana or something. We helped out at the daycare center. I don't want to play house. Let's play hide and seek. You're it. You this full of energy. Once again, the children target you from all directions. Your understanding has increased. Harukun, most of the children have been picked up, so you can go home now. I'll see you next time. You finished your job and went home. Is that it? 6,000 yen. Damn it. Oh, on the way home on the Samigawa floodplain. You see Yuta's mother sitting over there. Is this where you were... Is this where you were... Just talking about there she is. Oh, hello. Like I just legitimately was like I have nothing to do. I think I ha I can work on Mondays, so I went and did that. Because I remember that a little while ago you said that maybe you get Arcanas in side jobs. Oh, you're you're the caretaker I met the other day, right? Oh, it's already this late. I've been sitting here all this time. Um. Something on your mind? Oh, no, it's nothing. <laughs> You're a high school student, right? You seem so mature. I was heading over there. I was going to pick up Yuta. But then something came over me. My legs just went weak all of a sudden. Every time I think about him... She sighs. Have you heard? Yuta and I aren't related by blood. He's my husband's child. I've lived with Yuta for six months now. Only six months already. Six months. We don't even. We don't ever talk to each other. My husband is away, so <laughs> it's just the two of us. 
alone together in a dark house. Well, four ish. You got three of them. Really? Um. Just give it some time. I mean, why does she say dark house though? Is the dark poetic or is it literally just like you're poor and can pay for electricity or something like that? I mean, that's some stuff. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to tell you all of this out of the blue, but I'm glad you listened to me, that you spoke with me. <laughs> it's sad, but these days I don't even get to have simple conversations like this. She's smiling weakly. She's trying her best to adapt to living in the countryside. Yes, I'm bonding with Yuta's mom. She doesn't even have a name. Okay, who is she? Which one is that one? That is like 14... Uh, temperance. Okay, sure. Temperance is... I said this before, like temperance and like judgment. Those are cards that I'm just... I don't... It's hard for me to interpret what the fuck they are. Because they're like concepts. They're not things. That confused me. You have established the young mother social link of the temperance arcana. Fucking young mother. <laughs> that confused me. The card? It confuses me because temperance and like judgment, those are concepts. A strength is also a concept, but it's represented in like a lion and, a, and like a woman and a lion. So that one is easy to remember. But like then you have like death. You see a skeleton man, whatever. You, you the Grim Reaper, okay? Easy to understand. Uh, the devil, you just straight up see Satan. The lovers, you see two lovers. The moon, the sun, um, the fool is just some dude. It's like, the, the magician is a magician, the emperor is an emperor, the empress is an empress. Like, all of them are things that you can, like, see. Temperance is, I don't know what the fuck the card was. You may earn an XP boost when feeling percent of temperance, okay. Alright, sure. I'm Ari Minami. Ari Minami, okay, sure, thank you. You could have told me your name before I made the link. So at least I could see your name on the card. Nice to meet you. Please take good care of him. Oh, that's right. I still need to go pick him up. It was nice seeing you. I'm still looking for Tower. Tower is a bad card. Tower is actually a bad card. Welcome back. Welcome back. Okay. So is every card in every game? Like, is it all all of them every time? So there should be a tower at somewhere in the somewhere in the game. Oh, okay. I mean, I mean in like... No, okay. Because I don't know tower either, but I know that in 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 the Major Arcana in Tarot, tower represents a really bad things. Tower represents um, premature end to a journey. So it's like, you die, that's the tower. <laughs> Time with Nanako again. Tuesday night. It's almost 10 p.m. for me. What should you do today? Well, wait, maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, I, I don't know. We'll see. I want to meet as many, as many Arcanas as I can. Go out, yes. Oh, I think if I look them up, I will spoil myself. Yeah, probably. So, don't do that. <laughs> Where's the billboard to check new jobs? Maybe there's new jobs that will give me more arcanas. I saw the Risa was there, but Marie wasn't. Where's Where's Kanji? Where's my boy? Okay. This bulletin board. Oh, there's a lot of shit here. Oh, I already. Pub dishwasher. Okay. Sure, could pub at night. Okay, I'll do that. Hospital janitor. Uh, some diligence required. 
Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Take this job, yes. Uh, I, my diligence needs to be strong. Okay, I need diligence. What about tutor? Understanding. I'm pretty sure I get. I have understanding. No, I need saintly understanding, so I can't do those yet. Okay, that's it, yes. Okay. I need understanding and diligence. I thought I had pretty good understanding, but I suppose not yet. Well, it needs to be saintly, so that's a lot of understanding. I need to join like a church. I need to become a nun. Anyway, hi Rize. Oh, senpai. If you're free, let's go play. Oh, that reminds me, the other senpai and me had a study section for the license exam the other day. I'm a pretty quick study, so I'll be fine, but I wonder if those two will be okay. Jeez, if we don't work if we don't get it together, this summer is sunk. Yes. So glad I read all those books. <laughs> oh yeah, I should read more books, maybe. Yeah, where should we go? She looks happy. Okay, the station, Croco Fur. I spent time shopping with Risei. Of course we go shopping. Oh, was that it? Okay. I thought we would level up, but no. Welcome back. Oh, we can, mm, can we advance Nanako again? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah. I'm close, still didn't find that fishing rod. <laughs> Yeah, I, we were talking about the fishing rod earlier. How the fuck do you get it? I learned the fishing book. I don't know how the rod is. Okay, yay! Okay, what do we do today? Okay. Um, I lost the paper. I was supposed to return to school. Dajima probably signed it and took it to school. What should I do? The teacher will yell at me. I'll help you look for it. Thank you, Big Bob. She seems ready to cry with distress. You decide to search a house. Hmm? The paper surgeon is always going through our here. Huh? A paper titled Parent Survey Regarding Schedule Parent Teacher Interviews was written among them. Yeah, he took it. Okay. The word anytime has been written in the day requested box. Aw! He wrote anytime. Now talk to your daughter! <laughs> Imagine finding during the end game. That's more or less what it feels gonna happen. Or I just, I'm just straight, I'm never gonna find it, probably. Is this the paper Nanako was looking for? There's something else hitting at the papers. Just like a book of like how to be a good parent. It seems to be a photo. Oh, a family photo? You decide to show it to Nanako. It's, it's gonna be a family photo. You handed the paper and photo to Nanako. Nanako looks at the paper on the table. It says anytime I'll try on it. Anytime I'll try. Even what he wrote was depressing. Do you two want me to look it up? How to get the rod? If I get spoilers, it doesn't matter. Um, I don't care necessarily about fishing. <laughs> if you want to, you can do it, but I kind of don't care too much, honestly. Like, I'm actively not searching for it. If I search for it, maybe I could find it, but... It says any time I'll try on it. Like, even what he wrote was depressing. He's like, any time I'll try. It's like, okay. The fucking teachers don't need the dramatics. So he can come any time? Okay, haha, I don't think Bob being able to fish or not will matter to the story. I just want to see blood! I know. <laughs> I see. <laughs> And this is a photo. You were already holding it. Did you not look at it before? Oh, this is... Mom. This little baby in the middle, that's me. That's smiling. Why did that stop smiling? I mean... This is also not very difficult to understand, but you're a child, so I get it. Oh, this is... How do we want to play this? One. Or three. There's no three. <laughs> it's just one or two. Or two, sure. Like, both of these are... Both of these are very nice to say. I misclick. Yeah, that's fine. 
because he is lonely. You can tell. Definitely three. Yes, uh, we'll we'll choose three. The hidden third option. The third option that says I'm lonely. <laughs> Stop it, Lizzie. Um, because w he's definitely lonely as fuck. You can tell. But also, he also feels like shit that he's not around, but like he has to work, right? He can't just quit his job. And it, he probably feels like shit because Nanako doesn't have anyone either. Sorry, I like one, honestly. I feel like one, you can see more. Like you can see that he's very lonely. I honestly like one more too. So I'm gonna go with one. Huh? That's lonely? I see, so that's it. She realized something. After mom died, I was lonely, but I'm not the only one who's sad that mom's not here anymore. Okay, she she had an epiphany. She realized the reality of the situation. Dad, he was lonely too. I'm sorry, Dad. I mean, I like this, but I also feel like Dojima should walk in here and be like, I'm sorry, too. Like, it looks more mature somehow. You must protect Nanako at all costs. You feel that your relations have grown deeper. Are we at, like, rank 8 with her? Some shit like that? Yeah. Yo, the next time I make a Justice Arcana, that Arcana is gonna level, like, 10 levels. It's gonna be nuts. Nanako Dojima's reached level 8. Super close. Thank you, big bro. Will that ever smell like this again? She starts with the photo. Good night. Okay. I just want this family to be functional. <laughs> she did okay. What day is it again? I don't keep track of the days when it's like so much. Oh god, what's happening? Yeah, hello. Hey! Hello. Yeah. If you don't have any plans, wanna hang out today? Sure. Okay. Sweet! Let's see. I'll come over to your place later. Oh, yeah, Ko. Ko's coming to your house right now! Can't escape from crossing fate. He just walks in. <laughs> like. He was already at the door. He was at the door and he's like, hey, can I come over? I'm already here. He was like outside my window. Like as soon as I hung up, he literally just walked in here. Your room. If you are a little uneasy about having two guys in your room. Come on, Bob. It's okay. There's so many people I could have maxed way earlier in the game. Hmm. Your room's kind of weird. Not too spacious and yet not too cramped. Not too dark either. Hey, don't bitch about other people's rooms. W what? I wasn't bitching. Anyway, it looks like you're a little short on stuff to read. Why don't you take this? Ta da! The Ocha Way. Want it? I have no idea what that is for sure. There's so many. I'm sure you understand it. It's written to teach tea ceremony to foreigners. It's, it was way too complex for Daisuke, but that's not saying much. He's talking shit on that. He gave it back to me like a day after he borrowed it. Now I can finally stop lugging that stupid thing around. Big bro. Do we have a guest, Big Bob? Oh, is she your sister, Harry? We should all play something. Do you get lonely when your big brother doesn't play with you? You're very direct, Cole. No, I'm fine. Alright, then let's do your homework. Ko would love to help you. Huh? I, I would? You had an exciting day. Is this what counted to as exciting? Okay. Fear oh, Nanako also grew up from this. Every time I hang out with the, the sports boyfriends, you spend some precious moments with your friends. Every time I spend time with the sports boyfriends, they level up someone else to a little bit. Daisuke and Ko left your house before it got dark. It was weird for them to hang out here, but also... 
I kind of like... I kind of like having just people hang out at my house. It's like a very just chill, friendly moment. Get over on the table, yeah. Oh, yeah, I got a paladin armor. What's the paladin armor like? A lot of defense, no evasion. An armor worn by holy knights. Mo more chance to evade physical. Okay, sure. I'm a holy knight now. Wait, Kanji already has a power in armor. Cool. You can go. Okay, we're good. We're good. Ko back off. Ko was a little bit weird there, not gonna lie, but sure. Okay. He gave me a new book. What's that book about? What does it give me? Um. The Osha Way. Increases knowledge and expression. I kind of don't need that right now. I need... I don't need courage either. I need like understanding and... Diligence. Okay, these two. Okay. Let's, let's increase our diligence first. You begin reading office work manual. The manual contains useful tips on ways to be more efficient when doing office work. You feel like this will be a great help for your work or your part-time job. Yes. Okay. Let's become more diligent. Training. Okay. Oh! Yes, harvest vegetables. Can I gather the veggies? I'll go too. Okay. They look yummy. We've got. That was just one though. Uh, fucking wheat. Sure, let's get some wheat in here. There is no animation for them to planting them because it's raining, so they had to be holding the umbrellas up. Summer is my favorite season. Like in real life or in the game? Sentai! For me, I would he heavily disagree, game. Okay. In real life, I hate summer. But that's also because of the area I live in. In the game, I also also not really in the game because I don't like the outfits that they wear in summer. The winter clothing that they wear is much better, I think. I want to hang out with my boy Kenji. Can I get inside there? No. Okay, shopping this. I hate rainy days. Nothing I can do. And it feels like I'm wasting a day, essentially. I don't think I can work on rainy days, so... <laughs> it's not raining in the city, so... There's someone here. Like a quest. Woman with a heavy makeup. I want to brag. I want to go to the beach. But if I put in the hours and become a real full-time employee, maybe you can work a cool job in the city. It's so hard to balance your work with your personal life. I feel like seeing a boy in formal wear. I'm just, I'm in just in that kind of mood. Nothing too big or ill-fitting. Something nice and well tailored to make me go ah. They were selling something like that at a cocoa fur, but that's not enough. Hey, you're pretty cute. I bet you look great in it. Do you have any outfits like that? Sure. I'd like to see something you might wear at a wedding. Not ours, mind you. Don't jump to conclusions. This is the best fucking... I love it. I love video game RPG dumb subquests like this. You walk up to someone and they go like, I want to see a cute boy wearing a cute suit. Hey, you're cute. Get yourself a suit. So I can look at you. 
Don't tell me you have to wait until school starts back in order to continue his social line. I hung up with Kenji once, and he was standing in front of his textile shop. So I'm thinking he will show up there when not at school, but he barely shows up. Is something like that bring it? I'm interested to see. Okay, sure, whatever, girl. I mean, let's go watch the movies with people. Kanji. That sucks. Senpai, what's up? Yeah. Thanks for waiting. Well, huh? let's go. You found the regularly rushed, yeah. Enjoy watching the movie Kanji. Something inside of Kanji changed response to the movie. Level up! Are you sure watch all my movies on TV? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Same. We watch several movies with Kanji. It's the same dialogue. You only get custom ones for the movie that they really love. Welcome back. Okay. Again? <gasps> yeah, I think Ko boosted Nanako to the point that I can just jump to 9 right now. I will continue the story until I reach level 65. Yeah. Level 9! Um, We're breaking through the barriers. We're breaking through the barriers of, of brotherhood. Siblinghood. Precious Nanako. Can we get Nanako to 10 today? That would be crazy. I gave it back to Dad. He looked happy and smiled at me. Big bro, I love my dad. I just kind of wish we could see that. I just, I just kind of want to see more endearing moments with them. Um, what about me? <laughs> I think so too. Nice. She's smiling cheerfully. This is good. All is good in the world. Nature is healing. Dad didn't forget about how we used to pick flowers at Samagawa. He smiled at me and said, You remember too? Dad loves mom. I feel sorry for him losing someone he loves. I <laughs> feel sorry for you too. I think I just made no sense. I mean, a little bit. It's okay. Still has you. She's not lost. I mean, this kind of, this is, I'm assuming this is kind of like the, you know, when someone dies, they're not really gone. Because like the, what they were and the way they affected you is still in you, you know, kind of thing. Because that is true. Even if someone leaves your life, the imprint that they left is still very much real. But, uh, I don't think that's a, appropriate right now, but. This is good. Yeah, I won't go anywhere. Okay, good. I'm glad to be Dad's daughter. Smiling happily. Through that smile, you feel your relationship has grown deeper. <laughs> I just kind of wish we could have seen that instead of her saying that this happened. Oh, Nanako. It's your turn to talk. I just kind of want to see Dojima. Stop being such a <laughs> Like I understand I understand that his life sucks and that he's sad and tired and depressed But like I want to see him Pull himself together for Nanako more than Nanako pull herself together for him. I Wonder if I keep doing Dojima story. We're gonna see that instead, right? Yeah, like I want to see him understand her more than her to understand him more or like the best thing would be for me to see both and i kind of hope that if we do dojima's uh dojima's fr free time events whatever they're called here um maybe we'll get to see his side of the story more though it seems like it's going to be focusing more about the like the hit and run thing but hopefully he'll be more 
understanding of Nanako there or something. Or maybe in the tenth version of the Nanako Free Time Wheels, we get to see him there. It's your turn to talk, okay, about Nanako's bedtime. Talk to Nanako. Yay! Okay, good. Good, good, good. Wait, I don't think... Did that go up to nine? I don't think it did. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> no, well, which one is that? Social link, there we go. Okay, it did go up to nine. Yeah. Okay. I was just crazy. It's just crazy. The fucking fox. Full actress is a three. Young mother is at one. Teddy four. Yumi seven. God damn, we did a lot with Yumi. Forgot about that. It's again raining, so. Well, thank you, sports boyfriends, for boosting Nanako up to nine. That was good. Yum, 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 yum. Go to town, yes. Anything I can do? Like, there's nothing I can do in rainy days. Except, except go to the theater and get like a free level or something. Maybe there will be a poem inside the bubble room. Nope, okay, never mind. I think rainy days just literally no one spawns. I'm still gonna check, but I don't think anyone spawns from rainy days. It sucks. Janice. Adachi, you there? No, he's not. Alright. Samagawa. I mean, literally nothing to do. Save go to the movies. What if I watch this movie with Yukiko? Wait, who else? Oh, I can only watch it once with each party member. Let's go with Risei, why not? Oh, hi. Hey, senpai. What's up? Wanna ask me out? Huh? Kind of. Oh, you really did want to ask me out. The movies, of course I'll go. Oh, I'm looking for you in the front of the theater. See you there. Bum, 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 bum. Thanks for waiting. <laughs> it's just us, huh? And you called to invite me. Well, let's go. Well, let's go. Okay. Hope you like kung fu movies. Yes. Okay, leveled up. That was fun. I had a great time. Thank you so much, Senpai. Let's do this again. Okay, that was it. Blood? 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 The week ended on a wet note as rain clouds moved into the area. As a result, a thick fog is expected to form in the Inaba region later tonight. Blood? 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 I don't think this is blood. Well, maybe it is. But this... I think this was the limit for rescuing Mitsuo. I think this is... This happens every time. They go like, this is where he would have died if you, you didn't d beat the dungeon beforehand. But that means that plot can happen tomorrow. The fog will set in tonight. That means that plot could happen tomorrow. Yep. Midnight. Check the channel. I wish they showed their deaths. Why? Fog is set in. No one is appearing. Do you wonder what happened to Mitsuo Kubo after the police took him away? 
Sorry. You mean like get to see their death scene somehow, even if you rescue them? Because you'll never see. Oh, because if you don't rescue them, I don't think you see it. They just tell you that it happens or something like that, right? Fog is covering the town. Yes. Okay. Yeah, okay. I get it. Saturday. Plot could happen today, theoretically. Oh, yeah, then I was waiting for police to make a move. Okay, nothing to do. Hey, it's not raining today. We could maybe hang out with someone. I love that it was like the tease of like, oh shit, blood might happen, and it's like, no. But hey. We might get social links, so. That's good. Social links are really as good as plot. Marie, Marie, Marie! You're late. Didn't we have to remember a date for the festival? Um... Did we? <laughs> I mean, I think the game is just gonna tell me. Uh, August 18. I remember. Because it's... No, it's not 18. I think it was 20. I think it was 20. I was 18 is my birthday. Because I remember it was... I will keep my thoughts about what I've seen two months later. Okay. I was 18 is my birthday. So I remember they said something that was like right next to my birthday. So I think it was August 20th. Oh, you're here. Let's go somewhere. You'll help me remember, right? Yep. Yes. 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 Hurry, let's go. Do you think I can remember something this time? I said to take Marie somewhere so she come down. Bum, bum. Samagawa Riverbank. Contemplative Marie here. I don't get this. What am I supposed to do? The lady at the store said the scum was something special. She said it was old. No, it will do it by itself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't think the game would make... Just skip it. The game will just tell me. Yeah, she did. She also said that she's never seen one like this before. What did she say? Museum? Gallery? Would there be combs there? I don't get it. That doesn't make sense. What are they going to use them for? They're antiques. And what? You mean old and dirty things? Oh, but maybe it is. Just like those. The scum has no point. She seems impressed. Do you know anyone who works on stuff like that? Who around here will know about art and antiques? Ah, uh, I think Oman Daidara? I think old lady Shiroko is the one at the shop that sells weird shit and then she becomes like a host at the night. And the AI owner is the guy who sells tofu. So I think it's Oman Daidara. Anime figures are too expensive. Oh yeah, they are. My Gundams are expensive. I wanna buy a Gundam and they're super expensive. I saw a Blake- God, I saw a Blake Bill done a figure the other day. And it wasn't actually that expensive. It was like $30. The shipping would be expensive for me. But it wasn't that expensive and it was really good looking. I love Blake Belladonna. That would be a really good figure. I wanna get that one at some point. <laughs> oh man, they died. Come to think of it, the owner of the Dara considered himself an artist. Really? Yeah, it wasn't that expensive. It was only like $30. Shipping for me would be a pain. It would be like $50 at the end of the day. But like, the figure was really good looking. It wasn't tiny. And considering how good it was, it was mad cheap. It's from like a line of figures that are apparently really good looking and also cheap. I don't remember the name of it. But uh, my friend sent it to me and was like, oh yeah, this line of figures is usually pretty cheap. I love Blake Belladonna. I kind of really want that figure at some point. I don't think it came out yet. I think it's going to come out around the end of August. But they announced it. You can pre-order it. Give me something about this rare comb. Okay, let's go. 
So there's someone who might know. Huh, this song has a ton of weird people here. Well, let's go. Well, let's go. We'll find something out. Mind showing me a picture of him? Oh, I'm, I'm doing that. I'm doing that. Give me a second. I'll find it, no problem. Like... Mm -hmm. Uh, it's made by Good Smile. I feel like I showed it at some point in the past. It's a really good figure. No, I don't think I showed it on stream, though. I'll, I'll throw it on stream. This figure. This figure. It's a really good figure. And it's only like $30. It's a fantastic figure. Oh my god. I know, right? I want it. It's such a good figure. I don't really have figures other than the Curious right there. And Hierophant Green. But like, I want to start buying them. And I love Light Blue Donna. And I feel like that figure is perfect. So I kind of want it. Alright, let's go to Old Man Daydata again. <laughs> no, I want it. Uh, there's... I think there's another one of uh, Ruby, another one of Weiss, and I'm assuming they're gonna release another one of Yang. But Blake is my favorite, so. All right, this Elise, who would buy them? I buy a ton of shit from here. Don't talk shit on all my day Dara and his wares. Oh God, Yuki-chan, wait for me. All this stuff is so heavy. <laughs> I knew it. Good day, Hurricane, Mary Chan. Ah, Sensei, Emmy Chan. Emmy? Teddy, come on. Come on, come on, dude. Oh, oh looks like I stumbled across a big, big scoop. Well, well. And you too. Oh no, what should I do? They're onto us, Yuki Chan. I'm buying supplies for the inn. I ran into Teddy on the way, so I'm letting him carry everything. <laughs> what? Yuki-chan totally blew me off. It's all piled up next to the store. I can't carry another thing. Who's this? Oh, crew! Emi-chan, have you already forgotten about little Teddy? And after all that heavy petting you gave my fur. Oh, that's right. You never met Teddy out of his custom yet. Teddy? Oh, kindness and fur. Correct! That's my Emmy-chan! You call her Emmy-chan, bro? This is love! This has to be the power of love! Don't ruin that really good song by Hughes Lewis on the news for me, Teddy. Come on. That's the power of love! Da -da -da -da. Yeah, it's not. <laughs> what are you two doing here? Oh, shopping, I guess. We're doing some research. I see. Um, here? This. Hey, do you know what this is? Oh, -ho! this is... This is a very unique comb. What about it? Um, we'll have to learn about it. Oh, I see. I don't know anything, though. Me neither. I've never seen this before. But it's really pretty, nice, and shiny. Ah, that's why you're here. The owner doesn't seem like he- The owner does seem like he'd know about antiques. I knew it. Will he know anything about it? Why aren't we asking him? I'm not sure, but let's ask and find out. Alright, let the imbirrogation to me. Alright, that's a really good one. That's a really good one, Teddy. Imbirrogation. That's good. That's good. Hey, buddy, I got some questions. For me, huh? Well, unless it's about art, you ain't getting any answers. He's scared. He's scared of him immediately. He's literally right there. I know. Um, do you know anything about this? A comb. I don't sell comb. Hmm? This here is a beaut. Good craftsmanship. Pretty old, too. And yet it doesn't show much wear. It's perfect. Almost too perfect. Where do you get this? Um, do you know anything about this? We'd be grateful for anything you could tell us. Mmm, nope. It's a comb, definitely, but whether it's just an accessory or part of a festival, heck, I don't even know when it was made. Oh. I see. Well, hold on, hold on, Missy. I can at least tell you what it's made out of. This, uh, yeah, it's not your average bamboo. 
It's something similar to a rare type of bamboo that grows in the Shugoku region, but... But it's not. No, but it's definitely not normal bamboo. It's beautiful, though. It's almost think it's something from another world. Another world? So what world is it from? Jupiter. I didn't understand. Shugoku. Uh, let me Google where the fuck Shugoku is. The Shugoku region. Uh, okay. It's, yeah, it's a region at, in the southwest of, of Japan. Kind of. I see it. I don't understand. Well, she's about to remember something. Ugh. Atomica! My head! It hurts! Marie looks like she's in pain. Oh god. Oh god. Sorry, I'm trying to find something. God, my... <laughs> I'm drawing another parallel with my favorite character from 13 Sentinels. Which is this character. <laughs> it's actually my favorite character from the game. So maybe that's another thing we can draw. Maria looks like she's in pain. My favorite character from Gundam of Low does the same thing. God damn it. Okay, let's keep going. Are you alright? I'm on all right. My head, it hurts. No! All my favorite characters are the same thing. All my favorite characters say the same line. Okay, let's keep going. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on there, Mizzy. I have a first aid kit around here somewhere. Well, he seems like a nice guy. I'll, I'll go look for some medicine too. It may be faster to get some from the neighbor from a neighbor. I mean, I think. I think this is just a thing of like everyone's gonna walk out of the scene so we can have a, a moment alone with Bob and her. Wait, wait up, Juki Chan! I'll go with you. Yeah. <laughs> What is this? What the heck? I don't get it. This is bugging me. Something pops up, then it just disappears. Just when I had it. Take it easy. Calm down, let's try again. I don't know what to say. I I'm low-key scared that if we keep trying to remember things, it's gonna be bad for her. A little bit. But I don't see why though. She also feels like she's so desperate about this that telling her to calm down or to take it easy might be offensive to her. A little bit. I think so too. I don't know what to say. Take it easy. I wasn't doing anything. My head just started hurting and then it makes me angry. I still can't remember anything. She's trying hard to regain her lost memory. You can sense her urgency. Yeah. Rank seven. I'm going home. My head still hurts. Well. After thanking everyone, just scored Marie back to the velvet room. Damn it. We have to learn what it is. And oh god, blood! Wow, what a great spread! I've never seen so many pieces of fatty tuna. It's not only plot, it's a dachi plot. <laughs> For a second I thought you would you stop her social link. No, it's fine. Oh, okay. Well, if you're gonna have a celebration, you can't do it halfway. Blood! Blood. Celebration? Ah, 
It's about this. Watch. On the TV. I didn't care who it was. I was pissed off. I wanted to be famous. The suspect was often heard saying these things. <sighs> I feel like it's not him. The young suspect has confessed to being the culprit behind the recent cases, but he's shown no remorse so far. Because of several inconsistencies in the boy's deposition, some have called for a mental examination to be carried out. I mean, he does need that. He did. He does need that. Until then, Maybe he did the kill more Rocha, but... their investigation to shed light on all the prior incidents. It was actually really tough to make a case out of this. All we had was the suspect's confession and some circumstantial evidence. But the lab found the perp's mm -hmm. prints on the victim's clothes, so we made it stick after all. Which, which clothes? The last one? Man, isn't crime scene investigation something? Who would have thought you could get Bible prints from cloth? There's no more scary stuff to worry about. You're safe now. Uh-huh. Man, that guy was twisted. A high schooler committing multiple murders and leaving the bodies like that. He was over the edge. Good thing we caught him. Now I can stop seeing suspects in every shadow. If the killer was still he on the He did used to watch shadow. Do you want to point that out? Enough, Adachi. If you keep running your mouth, the sushi's gonna dry up. Oh, you're right. Sorry. Come on, everyone. Eat up. Well, since you asked... Wait, what? Well, he said shadows. And that is... I mean... That doesn't necessarily have to mean anything. Just like, oh, I'm looking around everywhere and I, I think I see a killer and like a shadow. And it's like, no. But also shadow is when you refer to the monsters inside the TV dungeon. I just wanted to point that out. It doesn't have to mean anything, but it could mean something. Huh? You don't like sushi, Nanako-chan? There's wasabi in it. Oh, that's right. I forgot to tell him to hold the wasabi. Here, I'll take it off for you. Which one do you want? Hmm? How is it? Excellent taste, Nanako-chan. All her was shadow. As for me, I'll go for sea urchin. Hey, there's only one of those. Mm. Too late. First come, first serve. Asshole. It's been a while since dinner has been this lively. Okay, there we go. Minor plot. Do we get more stuff today? Mitsuo confessed his crime and was apprehended. You wonder if the incident will end now? <laughs> I don't think they will. <laughs> oh, who's calling me? Oh, hello, it's me, Chie. I ran into Yosuke at Juness. He said he was really in a bind because he didn't have enough employees working at Juness. He's probably gonna come to you and beg for you, for you to rescue him. You'd be like, you're gonna save me from the scales, Haru. I feel kinda sorry for him, so I'm gonna help him out this week. You're welcome too, Harukun. Okay. Okay, so they want me to hang out at Janae's. You realize that you haven't bought anything from the home shopping pro Oh yeah, sure, whatever. Do you have anything? Yes, wooden bat. Uh, longevity pill. Yo, I can, I can be Majima. I can use a bat with Bob, like Majima. Then you can buy rice. I mean, I just bought a better weapon, so I'm not gonna buy anything. Whatever. Goodbye, Tanaka. <laughs> Yo, if Adachi ends up being the culprit, it's gonna be fucked up that he consistently hangs out at this house and, and has dinner with Nanako and shit. Okay. Go to town, yes. She's there. It's gonna be so funny, can't wait. She's here. Oh, you're here. Oh, she's more depressed now. Marie's in low spirits. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'll go. Okay, she's depressed. 
Let's cheer her up somehow. Let's bring all the friends that we made. Rubber bank. Murray here. She seems quiet. Hey. Hey, I want to be a dolphin. Bring out a dolphin. I want to see a dolphin. <laughs> she doesn't want to be one. She wasn't. She wants to see one. Okay. Something will happen soon. I can feel it. Yeah, me too. This is this is a good line though. I'm gonna count to three. By the time I get there, I better see a dolphin. You got it. Uh, Marie seems especially irritable. Ir ir irritable today. How stupid. One, two, three. Hey, where's my dolphin? Hello. This sucks. <sighs> nope. No, it doesn't. My head doesn't hurt as long as I don't think too much. Marie seems absent minded. It doesn't matter anymore. I stopped trying to remember. There's no point in trying to look for any answers, and in the end, I couldn't fi figure anything out anyway. Cow, no. Akira Mendayo! What can I do about it? I can't remember. I can't remember anything. <laughs> you can give, you can give the Missouri mode uh, colors like a like a little rainbow. I think it makes my head hurt, and even if something comes up, it vanishes the next instant. I hate this stupid jerk. <sighs> now it hurts. Just leave me alone. My, I hate this. My head hurts. All I want to do is to just remember. You can sense Marie's heart-rending emotion. I mean, this just makes me feel bad. Rangate. I mean, I I need to give this girl her memories or not. I don't know which one will be worse. Forget it. I don't need memories. I'm better off not knowing. Well, I feel now that we have to because she's given up. To take Mary back to the velvet room and go home. Well, damn. What is keeping her from knowing? Like, yeah, like her existence is bound so she doesn't remember or some shit. Oh, hey, we didn't talk to Dojima. It's been a long time since we talked to this dude. Can we level up his rank? Hey, Bob. I heard you do a top mark in the last exam. Keeping up your studies while talking, taking care of Nanako, too. You're one hard worker, aren't you? I need to act like an uncle every so often and give you some spending money. Here you go, a big tip. But don't spend it all in it. And now nah, you can use it however you like. 40,000! He just gave me $400. Bro. Talk to your child. Yeah, right? <laughs> Yo, Dojima, talk to your child. Do your job <laughs> as, as a parent. <laughs> I can't do everything here. Hey. Hey, Bob. What's wrong, board? Okay. Okay, yeah, we can spend time with him. Uh. You're that, board? Well, have a seat. This is gonna be about the hit and run and his wife, not necessarily about Nanako. You talk with Dojima about various things. Oh, never mind. At this point, you're her father. Yeah, at this point, I am a little bit. I'm going to sleep. Uh. Oh, oh, it's it's sad light already. Oh, all right, night. Yeah. Uh, what? <laughs> He's like, all right, sure, good night. What? You want something else? You said you would read me a book before bed. Hmm. Oh, 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 that's right. Um, I got it, I got it. Just a few pages. Yay! Bro, come on. Hold on. Dojima here. Ichihara-san! Yes, yes, then that means... Well, if it's okay with you, I can be there in just a few... I understand. Goodbye. Worst timing ever. Literally every time. Dad, are you leaving? 
Depends. Can you fall asleep in five minutes? It's my job. But you said you were me a book. I can do that anytime. You can't keep putting off being a parent. Bro. I like that I get to intervene. What do I say? What do I say here? When's any time? Because any time is never coming to. This is more important, huh? I like both of these. It's weird because I would say that is more important. Because this sounds... This sounds like I'm being sarcastic about staying with Nanako. When's any time? I like one more, I think. Well, two is more direct. One is more just... Any time is never coming. It, it, it hasn't come for, I don't know, how many years? How many years old is Nanako? Like eight? Any time hasn't happened for eight years. Just jamming, jamming to the music while the setting and what to say. That's that's what this game is. That's that's what this game is in a nutshell. Do we coin flip? We could coin flip. I don't see why not. We could, we could coin flip. Okay, give me a second. Uh huh. Where is it? Mm -hmm. Point flip. So heads is one, tails is two. Flip. All right, one. Bet it will be one. Yes. Well, you won the bet once any time. This thing is rigged. Uh, well. Uh, <sighs> He's smiling really. <laughs> He's like, this fucking kid got me. Are you two fighting? Y you can go, Dad. No, that's not it. I'm sorry, Nanako. I like that he's self-aware. What book do you want? It's okay. I promise. Come on, let's go, Nanako. Then I go into a room with Doja Man. Man, she made me read the whole thing. <laughs> All right, uh, let's talk. All right, this is good. I like this. The phone call was from Ichihara-san, my former senpai. Is this about the hit and run? That's what I thought initially. I'm having him run tests for Chisato's hit and run investigation. He was calling to tell me that the test results are in. Judging by his tone, he didn't find anything the police haven't already come up with. I know going over there would change the test results, but... He looks severely disheartened. But that's even like worse, because that means that it, he, he was going over there just to see test results. Like, there's no sense of urgency. It was a white sedan, most likely large and American, as expected, no such car is registered in Inaba. No records of one being repaired or scrapped either. Worst case scenario, the car's out of the country by now. It scares me that I couldn't catch the perp. That I'll never have an outlet for the sick feeling, that I'll just have to swallow it. Every time I look at Nanako, every time I notice the way she, the, I notice the way she looks like her mother, I feel like my face is being pushed down into reality, and it scares me. <sighs> I never thought I'd be talking to you about this. There's my confided in you. They're sending more. Yay. More... which one was it? Harafan, okay. I know I can't stay this way forever. 
Well, you're still here. I need to face myself. Oh, he said the magic thing. You sat with Dojima for some time in silence before going to your room. Thing about him is that he hasn't let go of like the crime, unlike the past in a way, but he has to. Oh, this is gonna matter because Bob's standing in the middle of the room, which he doesn't usually. Yeah, phone call. Hey, it's me. Yeah, you want me to work at Janice, huh? Sorry for dropping this on you all of a sudden, but I need a big favor. Can you work at Janice from today until Friday? We're short on staff. I'll pay you more than we usually pay our workers. Bob is basically his therapist. He is. Bob is everyone's therapist. It's me, Bob. Everyone's friend. I'll buy you lunch every day at work too, but I promise. Please, I'm begging you. He seems desperate. Bob is everyone's therapist. No, no, yes. We're doing it. Right. Oh, sweet. You're awesome, buddy. A real lifesaver. I'll be waiting for you, Juness, so I'll see you soon. Exactly. Bob is awesome. Bob is so chill, he can just tank everyone's problems by literally just sitting there and saying something really nice every now and then. Okay, we'll we're a Jeunesse employee until Friday now. Oh, we're wearing the apron and everything. Uh, why there so many people just for the hero show? This is so freaking tiring. But about Bob's problems, he doesn't have any. He's chill. He's cool as a cucumber. Thankfully, he does. Does he have problems? I don't think he does. I mean, his problems are everyone's problems. Does not. Exactly, he does not have problems. I'd be a zombie by now if you weren't here, uh, Bob. That's what he wants us to think. <laughs> At the end of the game, he's like, nobody ever cared about me. Nobody care about my problems, huh? He becomes the antagonist. He was the killer all along. Look at Teddy over there. Welcome, we got shaved ice here with all your favorite flavors. Dude, I want to try shaved ice. Like shaved ice is like a Japanese thing. I mean, it, it's kind of what it sounds like. Well, that's true. Uh, it, it's kind of what it sounds like. It's ice that you kind of shaved with like a, some sort of tool. And then you put like some flavoring in it. It's like a weird version of like a popsicle or like ice cream. But, but I want to try that. Like I'm more of a fan of like popsicles than ice cream because popsicles are they are water based. While ice cream is more like a cream thing. I anything that is more water based I like more, like ice. Cheer on the heroes while enjoying this tasty snack of frosty shaped ice. Oh, it's so hot today. That is to giving up a good pace. You have Yosuke in the food court. Well, the sun blazed down upon you. You became closer to everyone. Oh yeah, good news. All of us girls have our scooter licenses now. We're still getting the hang of riding them, but it's a little more practice. We'll be good to go. Though we need to finish helping out here first. Let's pick up the pace. Look at Teddy. Look at the Teddy animation. Just you work hard at Jeunesse. Oh, we just skipped a Friday. Okay, what's not expecting that? After the days of hard labor and the blistering heat, Teddy seems to be slowing down. Teddy looks like he's having a mental breakdown. Look at him. Welcome everyone! Beat the heat and eat some meat! Oh my god, I misread that. I misread that so bad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I misread that. I thought she said something similar but different. Anyway. Do I see a Dachi? Is, is a Dachi around here? I don't see him. Yanikiku, Yakiniku, grilled steak, ginger pork, chow down and restore the energy the brutal summer days have taken from you. <laughs> Try our tender, delicious beef! I don't see a Dachi. Man, Teddy's really dedicated, is he? Teddy's dying. I'm melting in the short sleeve shirt and he's wearing that huge costume and he's standing in front of the griddle. How does he do it? You help Yosuke with the food core while the sun blazes down upon you. Closer to everyone. Yes, relation with Close is gonna become closer soon. She is gonna become closer soon. Hey, tomorrow's the summer festival, remember? Oh yeah, tomorrow. Man, we just skipped past my birthday. It was it was 
it's August 19 right now. It was yesterday. It was August 18. They just skipped past it. Man, fuck this game. We just have to shine tomorrow night, okay? Then he needs to get paid double. He doesn't need the money. Well, maybe he does. <laughs> wow, I know, right? Today is the last day you had to help Yosuke. You earned 40,000 yen. Let's go! That's good. 40,000 is, is a good number. I just got $400. Again. Welcome home, Big Bob. Oh, hey. Vegetables. Harvest. Harvest, though. Look at this wheat. This wheat looks yummy. Uh, corn. The game heard what you said about your burger and just skipped it. I know, right? The game just, just the game is ruthless. Make my bestest grow. I'm excited. Okay, we're good. Okay. Nothing to do today, which means let's try to increase our understanding. Oh no, I just go to sleep. Okay. Sure. Blood. Summer festival. Okay, yeah. Summer festival time. They should have ended the stream right there, honestly. Because I feel like we might be locked into something important now. Funny. I remember this festival being a lot more crowded. Is it because of the murders? I've been practicing pre 4 g lyrics. I don't know them, but they're good. It's weird because it's like this weird Japanese English thing where it's sung in English, but you can tell that whoever wrote it was Japanese. Those are so weird. I know it's 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 a Japanese person writing English lyrics. Anyway. Yeah, there ain't that many people here this year. Well, I guess you can't blame people for being scared. I haven't seen the reporters around either. And they sure are good at stirring shit up and then disappearing. Comment! Well, it ain't so bad to have thin crowds. What is important right now is that we go get some Mikiyaki. I look at a few and they were funny. Yeah, I know. They're fucking funny, dude. Japanese English is the funniest shit ever. Japanese people trying to do English is the fucking funniest shit in the world. I love it. Keep doing it, please. Okay, let's get some ikayaki. Ooh, I want to get some too. Kanji, what's ikayaki? <laughs> Fucking Teddy. Where are the girls? Oh, we need. Mm hmm. Okay. Oh, Man, Bob got shaved crazy. eyes. Good. Why were they meeting up at Yukiko's house in the first place? They'll show up sooner or. Whoa! Isn't that them? Oh, they're wearing kimonos because it's a festival. Sorry we took so long. Sure. It took us some time to get dressed. You have to wrap towels inside so they're not as breezy as everyone says. It's kind of hard to walk. <laughs> uh, you don't have to... I mean, like, whatever. I would be like, you don't have to wear it, but I don't know, we are festivals. Just, just, just deal with it. Nana-chan, you look so cute. I'm head over heels for you. She's like eight. <laughs> Thank you. Daddy, come How on. Look, Senpai. Does the sight make your heart skip a beat? Not really. Where's my kanji option? Where's my kanji option? No, this game sucks. My kanji option, kanji option was the best option last time. Why do I have to choose one of these three now? This game sucks. Uh, fucking... I mean, I'm... I'm gonna say Risa because Risa's the one that said it, so I'm replying to her. Don't say sexy, oh my god. Exactly, like... Here's the thing, it said it doesn't even matter what they what the sentence says. It sounds like some like this one sounds the best one. This one sounds second and this one sounds the worst, but it's not even what the sentence says because the game just essentially wants to do, wants you to pick one of your favorite girls. The game is like, alright, which one do you want to be your girlfriend? And my answer is none of them. Because he isn't wearing one. I, I want the option that says 
Kanji would look great in a kimono. He should wear one. I want that option. What is that option, game? I'm saying Kanji option because the last time that the game had me do this, I chose Kanji. I wish Marie joined them. Yeah, but Marie is not part of the original game, so she doesn't show up for these things. But it would be awesome if she did. Anyway, you look great in a RSA, whatever. Mm, that slipped out so naturally. Perhaps you're used to saying things like that? It's weird because she, <laughs> she's like, oh, that slipped out so naturally. I, it took me like two minutes to choose that option. <laughs> well, I'm still happy to hear it. He seems happy. Yeah, whatever. Kanji, what are you looking away for? Don't tell me you're ashamed to look. What are you a monk? <laughs> what are you a monk? Th that ain't it. <laughs> you're so cute, Kanji. Hey, I'm just looking at the statue over here. After. They bought me cotton candy. Did they now? All right then. You want to go over and do the target prank? Uh, I mean, game with me? <laughs> uh -huh. Let's go. Looking like a true cop. I'll take care of Nanako from here. It's only a few times a year that this town gets charged up like this. You kids should go and have fun. Okay, cool. So she hung out with us for like a little bit. And now she goes with Dojima. Hmm. That's fine. A summer festival. No, Nanako. I mean, it's fine. She gets to hang out with her dad. That is like the one thing that we've been telling him to do the entire game. So... It's fine. A couple walking together at a festival. Unused to wearing it, the girl's yukata comes loose. Summer has begun. What is this? What is this, Teddy? Are you are you weaving a tail now? Oh yeah, but but what? But you wanted to hang out with her. We gotta go two by two. Rawr. He said roar. Fucking Teddy. Two by two? See, I've been thinking. It's the summer, you're wearing yukata, and we're at a festival. It's just wrong for guys and girls to walk around in a huge group like this. We should couple up while we're here. It's the natural way of things. What, what the hell are you babbling about? Teddy, chill. We're not just going in a huge group. Yes. I'm with Teddy. Fucking I choose Senpai. Come on, senpai. <laughs> Why wear you kata in the first place? So we have memories we can remember fondly, right? So we should pair off right away. She's gonna be like, I'm going with Senpai. Rise. What a terrifying girl. Yes, she is. You got a point though. Good memories. Uh, I'm fine too. Oh well, what I mean is uh, count me in. Kanji it is. <laughs> yeah. I want to be able to choose Kanji, Teddy and Risi. Oh my god, they're a good team. <laughs> the Thirst team. Except that Teddy is not even thirsty. Teddy just doesn't understand what thirsty is like, and he likes being thirsty without feeling the act of being thirsty. <laughs> Risi, on the other hand, that girl needs some water. That girl needs some water and make it holy. Still blaming Yosuke. You guys decide how we'll split up. I want to go with Kanji. Can I go with Kanji? Seriously? It's up to us? Can I hang out with Kanji? Uh, all right. Completely Yosuke's fault. Three guys and three girls. What should we do? Are they counting Teddy? Guys? Yeah, like. Aren't you missing one? You're not a real person, Teddy. Come on. What? Me, him, and Kanji mix three. <laughs> what? You did that on purpose. <laughs> um, should I really do this? Oh yeah, you can barely look at him. Completely. Well, we can agree on something. <laughs> no way. Everything is Yosuke's fault. Him. It'll be a cinch. Just you watch. Well, Kanji comes with me then. Nah, you should bail, Kanji. It'd be best for everyone that way. No. What? You don't believe me? Well, I've made my decision. Hey, wait till we're done for that. I want Chie-chan and Yuki-chan and Rise-chan for my partner. <laughs> I want all of them. Of course. Oh, Teddy. That's not a decision. 
Dude, you're the one who said we gotta pair off in the first place. I ain't joking here, Ted. If you try and butt in on this... That's right, Kanji. This is serious business, and you're a true man. He's so funny and cute. Oh my god, Lucy. A true man wouldn't be prancing around with other girls at a place like this. Okay. What what is he saying now? What the fuck is he How saying? How much more can you butter him up? Kanji, this is a test to see if you can uphold your status as a true man. What are we doing? <sighs> now no one will be left out. Yeah. You're right. Thanks, Teddy. You said it. Okay. Count me out. Okay. Count me out. Dude, come on. Don't fall for that. Oh my fucking god. It's decided. I'm going with all of you. Huh? What's going on? Don't they have a say in this? Teddy, you little well, I'm not mad. You go, Teddy. I don't... <laughs> I... Don't like Teddy that much. Oh, there are too many guys. So someone would have been left out. I just couldn't let that happen. What? He little... <laughs> I see. You're so kind, Teddy. We let them decide and this is what we get? <sighs> what a letdown. Oh well, let's go then. I like how nobody says anything. We fail, huh? I like how nobody says anything. Let's just hang out with the guys. I just want to hang out with Kanji. That's fine. An epic fail. Come on, bro. I, I get it. This game came out in 2008, but still. Hey, Teddy! Why are you buying another idol's photo? Mine's there too! Uh, Risa's good. I like Risa. Aw, oh, what's with this? Hey, Ted! Hands off my corn! <laughs> Teddy! You got ketchup on my yukata! Aw, oh, Teddy sucks! That's. Alright, I like this part. I like this part. That is just ruin everything for everyone. This is a complete disaster. That was perfect. There are only a few days left on summer break. What should you do today? Do you get freedom? Summer break continues. Yeah, summer festival or shrine. Hello, Senpai. It's me, Rise. Hey, you know that festival at the shrine is on out tonight too, right? Want to go again with me? Just the two of us this time, of course. I want it to be a special memory just the two of us shared, don't you? Come on, let's go. I feel bad saying no when people actively invite me. It's also like a special event because it's like the festival. So I'm gonna say yes. <laughs> let's make it a festival to remember. I made you at the front of the shrine. She hung up. Hopefully it doesn't get too out of hand, because we barely spent any time with her. That's a Hima shrine. Well, we'll stall her lined up from yesterday. It's just the two of us. I kind of wanted you to pick me in front of everyone else yesterday. Oh god, this is a follow-up of the choice that you made yesterday. Oh, this sucks. Where's my candy choice? Why don't I... Because this is fully voice acted, too. Oh, this sucks. But there were so many of us, and Teddy was there, so I knew it was impossible. Kanji, I know, right? I want Kanji to walk in. Well, it's nice that we get to come here twice, then, for the memories. All right, we don't have to make this weird. Come on, let's go. We're here together, platonically. We only have like one, two points of social link with First, her, so. We have to make a wish, though it'll be the second time I do it. I mean, it's fine because. This is like a special event, so this this is fine. I like having a special events here. What are you going to wish for? For Kanji to notice me. Uh, money. <laughs> <laughs> the game clearly wants you to choose this because the game is like, this is what you want, huh? And I'm like, no. And I kind of don't care about good grades, so I suppose the logical, the logical, by logical process of elimination, money is the only one of these that I care for. <laughs> 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 
money so I can buy video games with. <laughs> like fucking Josuke and Jojo Bar 4. God. I was rewatching. I was watching uh, reactions for Jojo Bar 4 recently. To get closer to Kanji and Marie. Yeah, the game doesn't want. The game doesn't give me that option, so I suppose I have to choose money. I was rewatching reactions for Jojo Bar 4, and it's fucking funny how Yosuke is. Josuke and Okujasu just want to get money. They just want to get money. And they just want to... Because they want to just go and have fun and play and buy games and shit. And it's like... That is such a high schooler thing to do. Just like, man, I'm broke. I want money. Poor Risa. She's trying. Here's the thing. I do not want her to fall for me. Because I already made my choice. And you know... The worst part about this, though, is that... Out of all the girls in the game, Risa is top two, second to Marie. If Marie wasn't in the game, I would have to choose Risa. What do we do? What do we do? Do we actually... Are we actually just taking it... Just, just taking a swing at this? Do we go one or do we go three? This is, I mean, it's kind of a funny thing to say. What are you going to wish for? Money. Uh, okay. We can say to become closer to you, but I'm afraid that that will hard luck me in a path that I cannot backpedal a lot of. So I'm worried. Mm. It won't. Mm. Maybe we can choose one just to be nice. And also because like Lucy said, she's trying. Because like I do like her. But like, girl? I'm sorry, but 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 there's someone else. Okay, that that's just that's just the way it is sometimes, you know. <sighs> but like that sounds like I'm actively hitting on her, which is mm, which is something you probably don't want to do. You have a choice in her social link to go out with her or be friends. I mean, yeah. So like in the gameplay world, this won't lock me into anything. But in the lore world, it would be mean to say this, and then to not follow through on it. What are we doing? Mm. <laughs> because it also, choosing just money, it also kind of sounds like such an asshole thing to say. It really does. Or oblivious. Okay, you can business me. Say money. <laughs> money it is. Is it just money? Because I am tr I'm thinking one, but also three. It's also like a funny thing to say. It's like... It's like this thing of like... Bob is so oblivious and invulnerable to relationships. He's just kind of set on his path, and his path is... I, I don't know, man. I just I just want to hang out and be cool. So, it's like, what, are you, what would you wish for, Bob? I don't know, money? Maybe Bob does care about grades, and that doesn't sound as bad as money. I don't know if Bob cares about grades. I don't, so I feel like Bob doesn't either. <laughs> And I don't even know if that sounds as bad as grades or not. Or, 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 as money. I kind of like money. I mean, I don't want to be a millionaire. That's not what I'm saying. I, I just, I don't know, man. I just want to walk and find like a hundred dollars on the, on the floor. That would be fun. I'll take that. I know Bob cares about grades. I like to think that Bob aces everything instantly. He's so cool that he just 
he's is just smart on his own. He doesn't try to get good grades. They just happen. He did rank one in the exam, so yeah. But I like to think that he didn't actually care. He just did it because he's that good. That's my head cannon for Bob. That's my Bob. He's unconcerned by it. You know what? We'll leave it up to fate. We'll leave it up to fate. So. Um, let's roll a 1d3. I'm not gonna not, not taking the first one. Let's roll again. And we see an actual roll. One. Okay. One it is. Is it just... It, it keeps giving me ones. Okay, no. Okay. So, yeah, I should choose one then. It wasn't like bugged. Alright. One it is. Like I said, rigged. Okay, Rizzi. I'm sorry I'm going to break your heart eventually. Well, if I don't spend time with her, I won't, I suppose. I mean, eventually I'm going to have to, because I like her, so. All right, sure. One. Thanks. Me too. Okay, it wasn't as impactful as I think it was going to be, but. <laughs> I bet we're both thinking of specific things on how to achieve this. Yay, harem. That's, I don't want a harem. That sounds bad. Yay. I like that she's wishing the same thing. I might have bigger, bolder plans than you. Uh, girl, chill. Right, it smiles mischievously. Chill! You made your wishes together. My wishes are buried there in airspace. Hmm? Young lady. Candy Apple Man. Aren't you that girl on TV? No, you got the wrong girl on TV. She's so direct. I love her. She's good. I like her a lot. I get that a lot. Sorry, it's not me. A real idol couldn't walk around in public with a boy like this. Ah, uh, so I got all excited for nothing. <laughs> oh, well, how about a candied apple then? One for your boyfriend, too. Mm. <laughs> so people do think you're my boyfriend. What should we do? Want one each? Or do you want to share one? One each, please. No, Actually, two for me. It would be really hard to eat. It would. All us vendors are handing out lottery tickets. You can turn them in for a chance to draw a prize at the Turee over there. Oh, we're getting those. <laughs> what? That sounds fun. Well then, I want two candied apples. Coming right up. Make it an extra one for me. I want two. I'm feeling hungry today. Let's look at the <laughs> other stands after we're done eating, Senpai. Do we get to... Yeah, we get to hang out. Yeah. All around. When I got one yesterday, it was huge, so I gave most of it to Teddy. Mm. Oh, but today you're here. Let's share one for real this time. Um, what exactly are we looking at? I don't have very good memories with fish. What I happened used with fish? I to have fish? in my room before, but I was too busy to take care of them. Oh, so they just died. But I'm sure they'll give us lottery tickets for playing, right? We can always just catch and release. All right, then it's one draw per person. Let me go get it. We're gonna win something. Like, I for sure. I'll get. I hope I can get something super weird so I can remember the day I got it. Yeah. Hopefully. Now, close your eyes and draw your prize. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I want a Tanuki. I want like a small figure of a Tanuki with a fat ball sack. Tanukis are good. I love Tanukis. You drew one ticket. Oh, amazing! Both of you won. I'm the telling you. Fourth place. So, a cell phone strap. Does he have a tanuki? Excuse me. Yeah, a tanuki. Have you not seen the tanuki statues in Japan? Oh my God! Give me a second. Give me a second. Yo, tanukis. Okay, so you know what a tanuki is, right? It's a Japanese raccoon dog. It's an animal that is native to Japan, and I think they are in other places but they're like we are raccoon it's like a mixture of a raccoon and a dog but in japan there's a bunch of tanuki statues like it's it's like a it's like a 
thing in Japanese folklore. And they have fat ball sacks. They have fat nuts. They actively have fat nuts. All of them. They look so fucking funny and derpy with their faces. It's it's so good. It's so I love the Senhukis. <laughs> oh my god. Look at this oh this one's so bad. Can I leave? You can leave if you want to. I love the Tanukis. I love the, the, the Tanukis. They're weird like that. Like, I actually love their faces more than anything. And I love that they're wearing this, like, traditional clothing. Like, look at this one. Look at the face on this one. And it has, like, the little hat. I love that one. Yeah, they're, they're cool. I like the Tanukis. <laughs> I like, like this one a lot. <laughs> I like this one a lot. Okay, we're <laughs> we have this one too. Oh, oh, there's all good stuff here. There's a, all good stuff here. Just throw them. We agree on another thing. Okay, sorry. We're just gonna. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. Okay, we we don't need this anymore. We can move on. But. We can have this one over here. That's fine. We we can have a Tanuki face over there. You have to take a shower, be right back. Or you're gonna have the stream soon. Maybe you'll be over by the time you come back, but I don't know. Anyway, see see you later anyway. Enjoy your shower. I I love their dorpy faces. And they're like fat and tiny and they have little hats. <laughs> uh there's a lot of really fun, like traditional Japanese like decoration and mythical shit the fat nuts is weird but it is funny to me okay a cell phone strap do i get first place <laughs> what is this character it's so ugly please tell me mrs tanuki uh, wait these clothes my tour costume last year looked like this wait is this oh is it a figure of you Oh, it's supposed to be and her. The boyfriend has sixth place, a book. Okay. The Divine Way. Was this written by the people at the shrine? <sighs> we saw a lot. Oh, do I, did he get a meditation book? Can I become a Buddhist monk now? So did she get a... A charm hey, that is like a figure Honestly, of her? You had other invitations today, didn't you? Uh, no, I didn't. Even if you didn't... I'm sure there were girls who were thinking about inviting you. Uh, Marie wasn't, so... <laughs> so, thank you for coming with me today. Well, see ya. I hope we can come again next year. Okay, the party with Risa and decided to go home. Well, that's that. Are people gonna continue to call me? No, I don't. I don't need to buy anything. Okay. I feel like I'm gonna end the stream. I said that I wanted to do so, so. Yeah, we've been going for like almost three hours. I feel like we can stop now. Oh, has to stop telling this girl she's leaving next year. Yeah. I mean. Yeah. But also, like. But also, like. I'm not interested, just straight up, there's someone else. There's someone else, like my amnesiac ghost girlfriend. But sure, whatever, that's fine. We're fine. So, anyway, that's it for this stream. I, I keep forgetting that Bob is gonna leave next year. <laughs> I keep forgetting that. But yeah, okay. I feel like at the end of the game, Bob could be like, Actually, I want to stay. And hang out with my friends and it's gonna be like yay i feel like that could be the end of the game after we defeated the bad guy or whatever bob is gonna be like i would like to stay with my friends you know that would be a fun ending and then they continue to have their, their f enjoyable fun times in in the small town of inava for for the rest of time that that would be a nice ending 
That's sort of the way Journal Part 4 ends, too. <laughs> Oh, depending on how melancholic they want to make it. I mean, it it would be melancholic if like someone dies or something. But like, I feel like if we beat the bad guy and nothing bad happens. I mean, people died, but it wasn't necessarily people we care for. Um, but if like nothing bad happens at the end of the day and we defeat the bad guy, we can be like, let's continue hanging out like friends. It's like, yay. And that's the way it ends. And it would be fun. Yeah. Anyway, thanks for the stream. Goodbye. Okay. See you later sometime on Discord or I don't know. I think that was a good. Yeah, it was a good stream. We did a uh, social links and everything. So we got Nanago to nine and Marie to eight. That's fun. I like that. But yeah, anyway, uh, thank you so much for hanging out. And oh, yeah, I need a song. I need a song. I need a song. I need a song. I forgot to check the songs. <laughs> All right, this, this works, whatever. See you some other time. And they care. Yeah, there we go. Goodbye. Danuki. D -d 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 Danuki. Goodbye. Oh, chose the wrong one.